Hi everyone, welcome to the tutorial of Electrical Pro, a software solution for the electrical engineers. So today we're gonna see how Electrical Pro gonna solve an electrical problem in solar energy installation, like the solar pumping. So this time we're gonna see the calculation of the power peak solar panel that will power the immersed pump. So here is the first example, we have the solar panel, we have the inverter, and we have the immersed pump. So we are going to start the calculation of the peak power of the solar panel that we are going to need for our pump. So as you can see, we have the equation of the peak power, which is PC, the peak power of the solar panel, equal to EC, the electrical energy split by EI, the average daily solar irradiation, multiplied by TR, the coefficient installation of solar panel. So first of all, we have to find the EC. So here's the equation. We have the electrical energy, which equal to the power pump, multiplied by the operation hour per day. So first of all, we have to clear all. So we're going to click on set and then on clear all. And now we're going to start the calculation of the electrical energy. So we have the power pump, which is 4 kilowatts. multiplied by the operation hour per day, which is 7 hours. So, the electrical energy equal to 28 kilowatt hour, as you can see here. and this value so we can use it in the equation of the peak power so first we're gonna click on store and then we're gonna save it on one So now we have the electrical energy, so we can start the calculation of the peak power of the solar panel. So we're going to start by multiply the average daily solar irradiation, which is 6.12 by the coefficient of the installation of solar panel which is 0 0.75 so we have 4.59 we have to store this value so we're gonna store it and save it in 2 So now we can find out the peak power of the solar panel. So we have all the values that we're going to need to find the peak power of the solar panel. So if you remember, we have already saved the EC, the electrical energy, and the storage one. So we just have to bring it by clicking on LCL and then 1 as you can see we have 28 kilowatt hour the electrical energy so we're gonna split this value 
by the average daily solar irradiation multiplied by the coefficient of installation of solar panel that we have already saved in the storage too so we just have to click on HTO and then 2 so as you can see we have the peak power of the solar installation equal to 6.100 kilowatt peak and this is the power that we're gonna need to drive our pump for all the day so thank you for your attention and see you in the next tutorial